Let's start with the full presentation of the dynamic line. I take the intermediate size machine, the 380, because the functions are the same anyway. To put the machine in working position, press the button and lower the telescopic handle. This allows to unlock the cable. Obviously, this hook should be closed. The height of the handle is adjustable according to the person height. This is my ideal position. To make a fast and effective de demonstration, you need to use the demo filter to see immediately the dirt coming from the carpet. To do this, we need to place the demo filter here, above the tube. Then insert the demo filter, fix the tube to of the machine. In this way, the suction of the machine passes through this filter. We turn the machine on, put in working position. At this point, we can check out how dirty is the carpet. Let's open the demo filter and see that a carpet apparently perfectly clean is full of dust. Let's use of dynamic carpet cleaner. We turn on the main switch, press the pedal and put the machine in working position. At this point you see there is an, a green light and a red light. They enable to adjust the machine in the right position. This is a low pie carpet, so adjust the brush roller eight completely down and we are ready to work. This is the right position. It vacuums forward and backwards, always pass twice on the same area, thus leaving the carpet perfectly evenly clean. Let's see now onboard accessory. At the rear of the machine there is an upholstery tool with bristle, a crevice tool, the extensible hose, the telescopic wand. All these accessories are supplied with the dynamic. In addition, let's put the tube in position. We have the DCS conveyor and spare filter dust bag. Then we have the lower cable rear hook, we have the cable clamp and we have a carrying handle. Now we put all the accessories in place. And the machine is nice and clean. Let's use the dynamic machine for the above the floor cleaning. Get the telescopic tube, adjust the height, attach the nozzle most suited to our function. And we are ready to clean corners. And above the floor cleaning. If we need to clean floors, corners, we can pull the vacuum like a top vac. This is the only carpet cleaner that does not tip over and later we'll see why. Put the telescopic wand back in place, hook the extensible hose in its position. How to remove the telescopic wand correctly? Rise and then unhook it. At this point it's free. So take it off, hang it back and place and fix it. Cable clamp system. This must be inserted uh, the top hook. This is very useful to get uh, anti-stress of the cable due to the rubber cuff. We prepare dynamic for dry cleaning. As we have seen the DCS conveyor is placed in the machine. Press the foot pedal and replace the conveyor for carpet cleaner. With DCS conveyor that enable to block the suction channel. Put the roller cover back. Remove the suction tube as the machine does not have the vacuum. 
Dynamic is now ready to dry clean. We use EcoDry LS500 to dissolve dirt, especially in case of spots. Treat each spot. We use the LD600 micro sponges. to absorb the dirt. And then using the machine we massage the compound. See how the distribution is evenly thanks to our brush roller which is running at 5000 rpm. Let it dry for 20 minutes. Put the suction conveyor back on for vacuuming. Dynamic is equipped with a full bag indicator that illuminates in case of clogged filter or obstruction in the suction circuit. Let's see now where the filters are located and what maintenance is to be done. Replacement of the filter, dust bag, remove it, close it and throw it away. This is the motor protection filter, remove the grill, replace the filter or clean it. The microfilter that is placed after the motor can be replaced by an optional activated carbon filter. It hooks or by the HEPA filter for healthcare environment. This filter is well hooked up in the same position. We can replace the standard motor protection filter with an activated carbon filter microfilter. In this way we improve the standard filtration system with an optional filtration system. Now we put the machine back in its original condition. Put the filter dust bag on. We have to go behind this ring. Hook the bag and put the microfilter. The microfilter must be positioned, hold it down, slide the grill back and snap it. Put the bag cover back and the machine is ready to work. Now the micro sponges are dry and we prepare the machine for the suction. Remove the DCS conveyor. Put it in the, its place, clean the machine a little and we are ready to demonstrate with the standard conveyor. Let's close it. The machine is ready for suction. Turn on, as you can see, thanks to the 5000 RPM brush roller, just one pass is enough to remove over 99% of all the dust. the black carpet you can easily see the micro sponges as you can see with a single pass the cleaning is almost perfect. Reattach the demo filter with a clean filter on the machine and so we are ready to vacuum the area that has been recently cleaned and sanitized. We turn on the machine and do exactly the same action we did at the beginning, in the same area. Let's see the filter situation. As you can see, we have still collected some micro sponges, but the filter is clean. Dynamic has two other roller covers, both in 30 and 38 sizes. One is suitable 
to clean on floors and carpet and one is suitable for delicate floors. Changes the roller cover is very simple. We remove the first one and put the roller cover for delicate floors. Now let's do the demo with the roller cover with the side wheels and squeeze it to clean both carpets and floors. Dynamic is a Class A machine for energy efficiency. Dynamic EcoForce is dual motor machine. It has a filtration system for hospital and has an integrated dry cleaning. Thus, it is a multifunction machine. Replacing the brush roller is very simple and it's done without tools. Just remove the cap, push the brush roller across that and it's it. Remove the side support that has a rubber, sealed bearing with a, an O-ring. All brush rollers are dynamically balanced and if necessary for synthetic non-delicated carpets, a harder bristle brush roller can be fitted as option. As you can see all the supports are made of metal with ball bearings. The internal support is also made of metal with wheels to do the edge cleaning. The transmission support, see the part below. Inside there are two bearings and it's made of metal. And this is our transmission joint. In case of clogging, the machine easy to check. Just remove the roller cover, remove the conveyor and as you can see, there is a direct line with the suction channel. In case of clogging, clean this area. Roller assembly, insert the roller, match it with the support, use the side support to pull in the last bristle, put on the bearing and close. This is the construction technology of Dynamic. Take off the side cover and have a look how it is made inside. As you can see, this is the Rotafield suction motor mounted horizontally, so when you can tur you turn the machine, it does not weight down on the handle. In fact, the handle weight is only 860 grams. As you can see, the housing support are very strong. Actually, this is made of out of metal. The brush motor, always made by Rotafield, Padova, Italy, is our motor. It is connected to the brush roller through a timing belt, a metal pinion and an electronic control in case of overload. First indicates the overload with the red lights, then turns off the brush motor. This is for total motor protection.